In this tutorial, we are going to see how we can test the control variables in a, in a regression model like this using S basis. To do this, we need to go to analyze, then we go to regression and then linear. And here is the model that we want to test with or without the uh, control variables. So we could just uh, take this out. So we want to test the relationship between the IV on the DV uh, with and without the control variables of age and or gender or education level, etc. So here we can just uh, test this model alone. Uh, so this is like the null model. And then we can test the full model with the uh, control variables. So this model is also called the reduced model. So here, once we test it, you see that uh, according to the statistics, we have the R uh, for the correlation, the R square, and then we have the significance of the ANOVA, which is statistically significant here. And this means that the model uh, fits the data. And then we have uh, this uh, coefficient that is 76% of the positive impact is predicted by DV or by the IV1 on the DV. So here uh, you can just observe whether this impact here is going to reduce or will it stay the same when we include the control variables, let's say social demographic variables. So let's just do this again and we go to linear regression and instead of using the IV here, I need to include, for instance, education and gender at birth. And then I will rerun the model. So you see that uh, this has not uh, been affected a lot, especially this one. The model st uh, is still significant. And then we have the, the impact of IV on DV is still within uh, 70%. It was, if you see in this one, it was uh, 76, but it has just been reduced to uh, 74. So this means that education level and the gender at birth do not uh, act as statistically significant control variables in this uh, model and they may be just overlooked. Even their uh, significance level uh, is not that, uh, you know, uh, worthy of inclusion or mentioning since it it is not statistically significant. So this is in brief how you can uh, test a model with, uh, you know, uh, control variables. We can just discuss this uh, by including other, let's say, uh, relationships like uh, mediation, moderation, uh, variables, etc. Especially when we have uh, structural equation models like this and the uh, interaction between these uh, variables is very important because if you just use regression analysis alone you are just testing the impact of one variable on the other which is at the very basic level but we need to see the interaction of all of these at once that's why we use what we call structural equation model we use uh, amos we use uh, smart palace for etc but i guess that uh, the uh, since many people just use SPSS, we can just continue testing the different uh, relationships using SPSS alone. Uh, so this is it. So stay tuned for the other videos and see you soon.